I don't think you're going to believe my answer. I don't think I feuded with anybody. Some pointed comments were made. Maybe there were some passive-aggressive statements made, but actual feuding, no. It wasn't that big of a you know, I'm just some guy writing about pro wrestling on a laptop at home. I'm never going to see any of these people. There's not going to be any winners or losers. Well, there were a lot of losers, actually, during that time, but no. The closest I got to a feud, probably, is that there was a well-known commentator who used to work at a site that I worked at, and as soon as he made it big, he dumped a friend of mine for greener pastures. And I really took some excessive umbrage with that, and that was probably the closest thing I got to a feud. But even then, no big deal. And that guy was a total loser, and I you probably know who it is if you know my history, and if you don't, uh, tough beans. See if you can figure it out by reading three years of recaps. No feuds, no. I mean, it's pro wrestling, yes, but writing about pro wrestling is not pro wrestling. And most people got that. And I think uh, anything that looked like a feud was probably just us having fun and trying to uh, up the readership for everybody by trying to include everybody. Yeah, it kind of worked, it kind of didn't. Then I kind of petered out because we all stopped. I don't want to say we grew up because we didn't. That's a good question, though. I, I If you want ex me to expand on any of that, feel free to ask another one.